Yes guys, this is one of the most important Bitcoin videos I will literally ever make because Bitcoin is right now going absolutely parabolic and you need to know what is currently happening because our Bitcoin spot ETF is literally only days away and Bitcoin could potentially reach $42,000 in just the next couple of days but in this video I'm going to show you guys everything you need to know because, because it's not going to be that obvious. Yes guys, Bitcoin is right now pimping like crazy and literally in my last video from just two days ago, I was literally telling you guys to prepare right now because it is currently happening. Literally the title was called, it's happening right now and this is why you need to watch all my videos. So make sure to like this video, subscribe to my channel and turn on post notifications so you never miss any of my uploads because literally I told you guys that this Bitcoin pump was about to come and it was just, it's currently happening literally just like I was predicting. Thing. So I was literally showing you guys this chart right here which is literally a Bitcoin bear flag. However, I was telling you guys that this Bitcoin bear flag currently has a 50-50% chance of breaking to either the up or downside. And guess what? We literally broke to the upside of it and right now we are pumping into some of somewhat of a resistance level but literally the second i made that video that was just around this level right here literally at forty two thousand seven hundred dollars i was literally telling you guys that i was most likely going to open a massive long position just around this level and yes guys if you uh, opened that position with me you would have been in a crazy amount of forfeits everything is literally explained in this video right here so go check it out if you don't believe me i was literally get telling you guys to long bitcoin right around this level so congrats if you did. But now guys, what is next? Why is Bitcoin pumping? And what is going to be our next area of resistance or maybe support? And where are we heading next? Well, first of all, Bitcoin is rich, literally right now pumping because a lot of extremely bullish news is literally right now coming up for Bitcoin. As you guys can see right here, the US, US SEC said to open talks with grayscale on spot Bitcoin ETF push. Literally, the SEC is right now giving in on that they're losing the fight against Bitcoin. We all know that the SEC doesn't like Bitcoin at all and they actually want to uh, just completely ban Bitcoin. Of course, that's not possible. So they're trying to just hinge hike Bitcoin as much as possible. They're just trying to irritate Bitcoin as much as possible. But it seems like they are finally giving up because Bitcoin just keeps on going up whatever they do. And they are literally right now in talks with Grayscale for a Bitcoin spot ETF push, which is extremely, extremely, uh, extremely bullish. Right now, secondly, there's literally right now an eight day window for a potential Bitcoin spot ETF. And it's what I already said to you guys in the beginning of this video. Literally in the next couple of days, we could potentially get a Bitcoin spot ETF, which is absolutely crazy if you think about it. Literally right here, a brief window opens. And this is from Bloomberg, by the way, one of the biggest news sources ever and one of the most reliable sources. A brief window opens on November 9th for the SEC to potentially approve all 12 US spot Bitcoin ETF applications, including Grayskull's GBTC. It will be open for at least eight days. And even if they don't approve it within those eight days, then they are still uh, expecting a 90% chance of a Bitcoin spot ETF approval. And literally this guy, this James Sef Sayer Fart guy, I don't know what his name is, but he is literally one of the biggest Bloomberg analysts. And he's literally saying right now that there is a 90% chance that we are going to get a Bitcoin spot ETF by the 10th of January, guys. I've been talking about this a lot already, guys. Literally, in only about two months and one day from now, literally two months and one day from now, we are getting a 90% chance of Bitcoin spot ETF. So somewhere within the next two, uh, two months, we are most likely going to get a spot ETF approval, which will literally send Bitcoin to highs you could have never ever imagined. Yes, guys, we are most likely literally going to touch 45 to 48 thousand dollars in 2023. Literally at the beginning of 2023, where we were literally trading at $16,000. And right now we are already at $37,000 and we are even more likely to keep on pushing. However, it's not going to be that easy, of course. We still do need to break some massive areas of resistance and support. And right now I'm going to show you guys exactly what they are. If you look at this Bitcoin cheat uh, support and resistance sheet, then we can see right now that we are literally trading into the biggest area of resistance we have seen all the way since that $31,000 resistance. And we can see it literally took over three or four months to break that 31K resistance. And right now I am still expecting the 
that Bitcoin is not going to immediately break 37k. Yes, guys, I am finally starting to turn a little bit bearish. Of course, for the short term only. Don't worry, guys. I'm only right now a little bit bearish for the short term. And that is simply because Bitcoin is right now running into its first major area of resistance. Literally, when we're trading it right here, I literally told you guys in all my videos that we were likely to continue higher because there straight up was no resistance. I was literally telling you guys this. And I think I'm one of the only YouTubers that has predicted this so freaking perfectly, guys. It's so freaking easy. We didn't have any resistance here. So this, air, um, this push was just really, really likely. And that's also why I exactly predicted it, of course. And right now, 37K is our first area of genuinely big, big resistance. So yeah, that is right now the first area we want to look at in order if we want to push up higher, we need to, need to break 37K. However, that will most likely not happen that quickly, simply because we still have two months and one day before the Bitcoin spot ETF will most likely be accepted, meaning we could get some more choppy price action for the next couple of weeks or months if we don't get any Bitcoin spot ETF major news. Because this massive pump was simply led, simply because, uh, do, because of this article, and simply because of this post from some big, big influencers and of course Bloomberg itself posted this. And that is literally what caused this massive pump to the upside. Well, however, right now that news is going to cool down a little bit. Everyone has seen the news. And right now we are just going to stabilize probably under 37k because that's massive resistance. And I wouldn't be surprised if we are simply going to chop a little bit around 37k just like this before finally coming a little bit down again, potentially to 36k again, because that's our massive area of support right now. We flipped it perfectly as we can see from resistance into support, really, really obvious. And that's our first area of support. If we don't hold it, then we have some support at 35k and of course more support at $33,600. So right now there is still a chance that we are just simply creating a much, much bigger consolidation phase. And I won't be surprised if we are ending up doing something like this, because it is still really likely that we are going to get a lot more choppy price action before we're going to see another big move, because the next big move, in my opinion, will not be led by speculation, but will actually be led by Bitcoin spot ETF approval. If you want to break through 37K, that will literally mean that we need to break 37K, which is massive, massive resistance. And it could only be done by some massive, massive news that has to come out. And the biggest news that could potentially come out right now is, of course, a Bitcoin spot ETF approval. So if you want to trade this price action right now, which is really, really easy, all you can do right now is simply short with the stop loss just around here and a take profit right here. That's going to be a crazy, crazy trade. I will just post it here for free. You can easily take that in my opinion. I'm also probably going to take it myself. You can literally right now trade over on Bybit. That is literally where I am taking all my trades. If you right now go to the first link in the description, you can literally claim up to $30,000 in reward and 25% of fees. It's literally the best exchange ever. And yeah, guys, crazy deposit rewards, crazy price pools. Everything is just crazy about Bybit. I would recommend signing up. And if you sign up with my link, you really, really help the channel out. Plus you get a small bonus and I get a small bonus. If you don't use my link, we don't get the bonus at all. We don't get the, we both don't get the bonus. So go check it out, guys. Then, uh, if we look at this chart right here, we can see right now something really, really interesting that is currently happening. Let me quickly position my face cam just like this, because we can right now see that we are currently creating the four green candles in a row. And the last time we did this was all the way at the 1st of January. We created the second, uh, the second 2023 K. We uh, actually created four green candles in a row. And after that, we have never seen more than four green candles in a row. And the last time before this was literally all the way around here in the August of 2021 was the last time we actually created four massive green candles in a row just like this. Because if we look at right here, we of course did make four green candles in a row. However, the first one and the last one were really small. And right now we are literally creating four massive green candles in a row. And the last time we actually did that was here all the way in July and August of 2021. And this is one of the other reasons why I think we are most likely going to see an, a red candle in, an, in, an, uh, in the coming week. Because it, it, Bitcoin just can't go up forever and it needs to see at least 
somewhat of consolidation and potentially a small dump to the downside and that is why right now why i think that bitcoin is going to come down quite a lot here in the next couple of weeks right now also we are still of course we are pumping however we can see that the volume is drastically declining right now and even on this massive pump from today we are still declining on massive massive volume which is creating somewhat of a bearish divergence of course because the rsi is also right now uh, creating lower lows still will bitcoin is going up which is not a bearish sign at all of course so yeah guys right now bitcoin is looking really really good and i literally predicted this i hope if you bought a lot of bitcoin at around 15 to 20k you are right now printing even if you're not into a bitcoin trade you need to of course hold somewhat of bitcoin in your spot wallet so congrats on that because bitcoin will continue on pumping in the next couple of years and if you're watching this video right now just know that 2024 and 2025 are going to get much much more crazy so yeah guys that being said i would really appreciate it if you could like this video and subscribe to my channel down below and maybe leave a nice comment i would really appreciate it make sure to turn on post notifications like this video guys and that being said i literally hope i will see you guys in my next youtube crypto video